Like, oh, you push standing medium punch? Well, I'm gonna dodge it. Alright, back to Charlotte then. <laughs> Jumping heavy slash all day. Yeah. Get it, girl. It's first stage and she's already doing nothing but block. That was like a... That was like a close medium slash. Why did that hit twice? But yeah, this game is... This game is not easy. It gets worse, too. Like, I think two is harder than, than this, even. Splitter into gold coins. <laughs> Satisfying. It always feels like when you fight against like AI Charlotte in this, like she always anti airs everything with withstanding heavy kick. I'm not mashing on those anymore now that I've I've learned that it's rigged. Look, I already did enough mashing in three count bout tonight. Perfect. Am I on the fastest times? Nope. Oh, eat the fart. Not a combo, dummy. Dun, 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 dun. God, the hit stop in this game. It's insane. that out. How many stages is that? Like, six? No, that's only two stages. Oh, yeah, that was the, the, uh, the big deal with this when, uh, like, they released the home cartridge of this. Like, they... Whoa! Nice hitbox. If you had a if you had a US Neo Geo system, like all the blood was turned white and you didn't have the, the finishing moves. And they didn't give out a code for it. Which is so insanely stupid, because there weren't kids with unless they were like really spoiled kids that had like Neo Geo Neo Geo consoles. Anybody who was paying two hundred dollars for this probably somebody with disposable income. And so you just take out all the blood and turn it to sweat when, you know, anybody, any kid can go to the arcade and see the blood. It made no sense. Oops. Boy, uh... Why can't I get a grab? I still don't understand the throw system in this game. Shit. Hey! Nice. That is true. Maybe some kids won them on, on Nick Arcade or... Were they prizes on Video Power, too? 
Every time I watch Nick Arcade, I'm like, play the Neo Geo game, play Magician Lord. Except if it was like Robo Army. Don't play Robo Army. Okay, how bad am I gonna get trolled here? It begins. Hey. Uh huh. Yeah, last time I played this, like, it went, like, three or four seconds without popping up any of the, the straw men, and then, like, right as time runs out, like, it pops one up. It did that twice in a row. It was... It was pretty funny, in retrospect. I was mad, though. Oh, give me the meat! Oh, yeah, he's got an air grab, huh? That's a slow projectile. <laughs> I can land the jump heavy cap. Heavy slash, but then I can never combo after it because combos in this game are hard. I creamed it. Uh -oh. oh, don't give him the gold. Ah! Uh -oh. Boy, that has some active frames. That was an accident. I'll take it, though. No, don't knock him into the hell. Fuck. Oh my god, he's not even, like, maxed, and he did, like, 40% with one jumping heavy slash. The damage cheating's already started. Oh wait, this, this, this cutscene was really bad. It had a lot of flashing lights. Sorry, I have to skip it. No, she didn't get a projectile until 2. It's really bad in 2, also. It's really slow. Lights aren't banned, it's just it's kind of an obnoxious cutscene. I'd rather just avoid it. Ooh. Wow, the wrong way, huh? But yeah, the 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 English in this game is like... Oh man, stage clear time, second. It's a world record. The translation for this can be pretty funny. Like, SNK is like, uh... The quality of SNK translations were like all over the place. Because they went from this, from having all these... They just made a... A Wayne's World not joke for Ukyo. Well, you know, they did they did some funny stuff for this, and then they went from this to Samurai Showdown 2, which, uh, uh, not good. <laughs> Ugh. 
That wasn't gonna chip. I don't know why I did that. Yeah, that's from the, uh, from 2's intro. Long, long ago. <laughs> oh yeah, that, that one name in Samurai Showdown is for, for its credits. It's, it says, fuck all yo all. I wonder who that was. Samurai 4 has got a pretty, pretty bad translation. Not as bad as 2, but it did, it did give us Victor Lee. And that probably counts for more. <laughs> Split that castle in two. I think Victor Lee was four. God, I used to actually know strats for four, and I, I don't now. <laughs> I have to relearn that game. Three's gonna be the hard one. I don't know shit about three. I gotta get Polar Bear to give me a crash course in it. Just pick Galford, I guess. Plucky you are. punish. The fucking slowdown on breaking the chandelier is fucking me up. I didn't want to do my own splash mount. I was just trying to punish. That did nothing. Oh god, that crouching heavy. Whoa. Three Fighter One Mike Strass? so slow. How was I close enough for a close standing medium punch? I couldn't punish that? Oh god. This game is stressful. Game is stressful. No, I'm not related to that guy in Fatal Fury. <laughs> Jump heavy all day. Oh god. What are you gonna do about it? You gotta air to air me. Wow, Jate. Yeah. 
I appreciate you making it SNK related though. Man, Jubei, Jubei's mad easy. He doesn't know how to jump. My eyes are blue, but I know samurai spirits. Gary Ford. I'm never close enough for close standing heavy punch. Nice! 3% damage punish. What? Why did that dizzy? That was like a... That was close standing medium punch. I understand getting dizzied if it was like close standing heavy punch, but... I got dizzied off a of medium? Of course I don't understand stun in this game. I'm gonna make the dog cry. How many stages do I have left? Three. And the boss. We meet again, Genon. Sick punish. Oh yeah, I remember last time I was actually trying to, like, anti-air that with power graduation, and... Even when I did it early, I was getting hit. Japan Wiki has a long page on versus CPU strats for this game. Good. That's good to see. Uh-oh. <laughs> hitbox! Look how much damage that did. That was a heavy slash. I'm just never, never better off like going for ground attacks after a jumping heavy slash. You just run up and do another jumping heavy slash, I guess. Oh god, my health, my health! That dizzy? What? Why did I get dizzied off a throw? Excuse me. Hold on. Did you... I was trying to counter mash out of it too. That's the worst part. Uh oh. Stunned off like the dumbest shit. <laughs> off Genon's mash throw, off Galford's standing medium slash. I don't get it. I did a combo. That... That dizzied me. He wasn't even... His power meter wasn't even fully maxed. 
I'm playing on the default difficulty, by the way. I'm playing on level 4. Just thought I should mention that. I'm not going in. He has max power. Okay. What the actual fuck? Four of eight. Hey, I gotta grab. Oh god, he's got max pal. Fuck it, I'm out of here. Okay. What a hit trade. Ooh, with punish. Yeah, 4 is the default on most Neo Geo games. Some of the early games had, like, different defaults. Like, I think Fatal Fury 1 defaults to level 5. Some of the early games defaulted to the level 3. US version of uh, Puzzle Bobble, Bust a Move, defaults to 6. Pagana, Pagana. Keep jumping all day. Oh, you can't jump out of the dash. I forgot. You have to act. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm surprised I didn't stun. We take this. Oh, yeah. Nam 1975 might... Level 5 might have been what I was thinking of. But I know there was, there was something that defaulted to level 3. But it was before, like, uh... Because, like, the early Neo Geo games didn't have an option to display the... the difficulty level at the bottom. Like, around the time of Fatal Fury 2, that's when they started adding that option. They made it... they made it, uh... available by default. Thank you, leg. Ah! Uh, nice hitbox. Just timer scam him. Maybe. Lucky Glauber's like a descendant of Amakusa. That doesn't work. I don't know why I thought it would. Good start. I know you can't hit him when he's laughing. I'll take that trade all day. Uh oh. I don't know about that though. Yeah! Get fucking duffed. Sweet. 
<laughs> Thank you, Ancient Plotter. Thank you for the you did it and the GG's. This game has a... Oh god, that's a lot of flashing lights too, though. Forgot about that. This game does have a special one credit ending. Somebody get a body bag! <laughs> no, man, thank you for the bits. That's a good bird. Follow me, bird. Oh man, how do I play as him? Never mind, he's dead. Wow. <laughs> Game clear. Continue zero. Rank. First, I guess. I am Magnifique. The end. Congratulation. Yeah, you only get this part for a one credit clear. Yeah, forget the French Revolution. Let's just go murder people in Japan. And the lady's all up on him. The fool. Man, the fool gets around. Show. Surprised more people didn't work on Nakaruru considering how much everybody fucking loves her. The dead zone where his AI doesn't know what to do and it just mashes buttons that can't hit you forever until time runs out. The Street Fighter 1 mic strats. Poppy design. Oh man, I'm gonna bookmark that. Poppy is Galford's dog, yeah. Yeah, it's up to the arcades to set the difficulty, but... Most places, I think, left this on level 4. All the arcades I saw left it on level 4. Because they, uh, they did leave it uh, the level display on by default. You can actually turn it off. You can turn off the level and the credit displays, but it wasn't until like later games they started disabling the level by default. Special thanks to SK! SK got a shout out in the credits. SK always wins. <laughs> oh, that, oh, that's a mini thank! <laughs> I forgot about that. Boing! It wasn't... Uh, it wasn't a vanilla thank, though. It was mini thank. It's up to Scuddy whether or not that should be added, though.
<laughs> visual novels are drying up. No, this isn't original hardware. This is MAME. But yeah, like I mentioned... Or, oh, I forgot to update the game counter. 